Next point, 3 comma negative 3 pi over 2. Good, good, good problem. Because the axes ones, I feel like, gets a lot of students. Well, just remember, guys, first of all, we see the negative. So that means if we're, like, I'm just pretending this is the unit circle here. Obviously, you guys can see how small the unit circle really is, right? But when we like to expand it, that helps us graphing. We just did a positive angle, which just means going in the positive direction. So negative direction is going this way. And again, we're talking about 3 pi or halves. Well, think about halfway around the circle is pi. So therefore, half of pi is pi halves, right? So if you're going in the negative direction, you're at pi halves. This is really 2 pi halves. So this would be 3 pi halves in the negative direction. So we're over here. And then remember, r comma theta. r is your radius, so we'll go up 3 units. And that is point E. Okay. Oh, quick thing. Can we check to make sure we did this correctly? Can we check? No. Could we convert this to a rectangular form? Or so we have an r as theta. Could we rewrite it as r cosine theta, r sine of theta, to make sure we did it correctly? Could we? We could. If we're kind of confused, and that's why I said when you guys get confused then write it in rectangular form. See what it looks like. So why don't we do it for this one, because this one's relatively simple. 3 cosine of negative 3 pi over, ha over halves, comma, 3 sine of negative 3 pi over 2. Now, let's look at the unit circle. Because guys, does it really matter if it's on the unit circle or up and up? Like, the point's the same, right? What is this point coordinate point here on the unit circle? Yeah, but what's the coordinate point, the x, y point? 0, comma, 1. So what's 3 times 0? Zero? 0. What is 3 times 1? 3. Is that the x, y coordinate here? Because remember, guys, the polar graph is really just being imposed on top of the x, y axis. right? So you can graph it as a rectangular coordinate. Like This is very simple to graph as a rectangular coordinate. right? So we won't really say that like polar is, very easy, is easier. However, this one might be easier. This one's easier to represent or to graph in polar form than it is rectangular form. But these actually, you would say these are kind of equivalent. Is this 3 comma negative 3 pi halves the same thing as 0, 3? Yeah, it's the same point, right? So if you get confused on trying to sketch them, um, sometimes it's easier to represent them in rectangular.